Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, please like and subscribe. Yeah, yeah. That good. Yeah, yeah. Ha, ha, ha. Good morning. Nothing's muted, right? We're good? We're actually good? <laughs> okay. Right. So we're actually not playing on this farm today. I just, I just running out of time. I'm working on this now. I'm just running out of time. So we're going to be switching over. Hey, Jace, how's it going? We're just going to write all these names down for a new farm that's going to be cross-platform, so we can add all these names that have donated to Children's Miracle Network through our link down below to the new map. So we got Kiram Gaming. Thank you to everybody that's donated here. Super, super appreciate it. So we're just we're just finishing setting up the other map. Fearsome Rhino to YouTube. And we gotta count all these letters too, because they're gonna be a hundred bucks each. And our other map has new money. Thunder. There's going to be a lot of letters here. Tori. The. Sloughfin. Bunny. Hey Eddie, how's it going? Dreams. I wonder what the coyote dreams about. Hey, Grace Point, how's it going? Yeah, we're gonna go to El Dorado, and it's gonna be cross-platform. Hey, Logan, how's it going? We're still gonna come back and play this map. Just we're gonna do a cross-platform. There is coyote dreams in the house himself. It's doing good, Eddie. Awesome, awesome. Logan says they're doing good as well. Uh, sin, fully sinister. And then we got the ramps. All right, that's it. Let's uh, bail out of this map here. Uh, quit. Yeah, uh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. No, how many letters is this? Let's let's count them. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Oh boy, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, thirty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, forty, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, fifty, four, eight, sixty, three, six, nine, seventy, three, six, Nine eighty three six nine one hundred. And we got two, three, four, five, six, a hundred and six. Hey, how's it going, Michael? A hundred and six. Okay, one oh six. We're going to remember that, right? Quit game, yes. Okay, good.
set this as active. Perfect. We need to go into the game. That's not where I wanted to go. Alright, money. We need to add. So we said 106. So it'd be 10,600 plus this number, which would be 2188. So this should read 12. 788. This is how, by the way, you cheat in as much money as you ever want in the game. You, you could add basically just billions of dollars into the game by doing this. So now we have $12,788 in game, and uh, that'd be half a million and five thousand dollars of debt so over half a million dollars of debt in our game I could just delete that right here right now so save we're gonna play El Dorado El Dorado with just a few mods no DLCs just a few mods Love this FSG mod assistant. So nice. It certainly helps you control all your, separate all your mods. Doesn't make the game have to load everything for every. All right, create multiplayer map. You see how all these maps are just invisible? That's because we didn't download the mods for these maps. Here we go, El Dorado. So yeah, that's it. We got some, the fences pack come with the map. And then we did the sugarcane equipment that came with the El Dorado map as well. And uh, no DLCs. And just the numbers that for writing it uh, people's name. Um, the sword fighting yesterday, Michael, was really pretty awesome to watch. That was that was kind of fun. It was kind of fun. I I enjoyed it. First thing in the morning was all the heavy sword fighting. You know, with the body armor all over the metal helmets and all of that. And, well, not just sword fighting. Some, some of them had hammers and stuff like that. Just, it was pretty cool. Here we go. Loading El Dorado. With no money. What? Why do we have no money? Okay. What happened? I put money into the wrong map. It's save game 10. It says... Here it says we have 2018. It only shows $12. What? It shows right here. Oh. Oh, maybe. Maybe I didn't join the farm. But it said $12. I'm just going to rejoin one more time. Just what? What? Itch in here. Itch in here. What? What's going on? Set this up before anyone joins, okay? Let's see if we've joined a farm. We are on 
best farm. It says twelve dollars. Doesn't make sense. Let's just save game, quit, and see what that did to the to the menu. Now it says 12 there, okay. So I screwed something up. Yeah, it says 12 there, all right. You guys remember what I put in there? Because I cleared it off my calculator. did I put in there? Dang it. I don't know what we started with. That's how many letters we needed, but we had money in there before that. But how much? I think I said 12. I think I said 12 something. So let's just put in 13,600 and call it good enough. It'll be a little bit more money than we had. Only, only a couple of hundred. Okay, file, save. Let's see. Let's launch it again. <laughs> Partly cloudy. It is, I'd say, 95% blue sky here. Okay, we'll figure this out. Don't worry, I'm just making this up as we go. Um, this will still show wrong at 12, but, but let's load in. So 50% blue sky for you. Yeah, we got you beat there. And it is 10 degrees Celsius. we have money. All right, so this is our starting house over here. Um, let's show you what we own. So we own our house in the very corner here where we start. And we own one field. That's it. But we do own quite a lot of, equi quite a lot of equipment. So let's go Oh boy, this thing has such poor disrepair. We have quite a bit of equipment, but nowhere to store it, nowhere to repair it, no money to repair it. Tailgate's open. How do we close that? Close our tailgate. Potatoes are loading. It'll be a little laggy till the traders all load. But this is all our equipment over here. This is this is everything we have. We've 
got two tractors, a Massey Ferguson and a uh, Ford, uh, I guess it would be New Holland. And sugar, sugar cane planters and harvesters. That's it. But before we start that, where do we put up everybody's names? We'll be driving between here and our field. This way. What about putting people's names along the uh, fence over here? Or along the side of the road over here? Just right along the side of the road on that side. It just seems like a good idea. It would allow us to place it there. Uh, me speeding? What? Why sugar cane? Uh, this map is designed for sugar cane. Uh, where's our field? Up in this case. Big roundabout. Now this map has got all the sugarcane factories and stuff over here. I have no idea how to do sugarcane. I've never done sugarcane in my life. I've played this game for how long? We've never done sugarcane. here to get to our field. So that's our field here. What does it need? Does it need plowing or anything? Oh yeah, definitely needs plowing. When can we plant sugar cane? Oh, <laughs> not until September. Okay, well, we have time. We definitely have time. And since we're going to be bringing everything over here, all our equipment, everything will have to be stored on this field. Or, yeah. Yeah, it's all going to have to be stored on this field. Where are we going to store it? Just back it into the woods over here? Probably for now until we figure this out. We'll probably put sheds up on this field. This will probably be our farm base. Put up sheds and everything up here and slowly the field will become smaller as we make money. Okay. We will have to walk back home once. After this, we can drive home with the pickup. There's a walkway here. Can I just take the walkway? That's safer. The music is peaceful, Jace. It's just uh, YouTube. The YouTube playlist. If you ever want to know what name it is on the YouTube playlist, right at the top there, underneath the uh, fundraiser uh, bar, it says the name of the song. And right now, it's hopeless. And it's got the the name, the author, and how long till the song ends.
Uh, will it allow us to place? Let's just take a test here. Not landscaping, decoration. Uh, not owned by you. So we're gonna have to buy the property to place these and, and then sell the property after we place them. We don't have the money for that. Okay. Okay. Let's uh, save and quit again. Cheat in like a million dollars. And then we'll cheat out the million dollars after we place all the names. I want to do production on all my maps. I enjoy doing production, so it just takes a long time to get there. I guess the more people join and help us, the quicker we will get into production. But uh, yeah, there's a huge sugar cane factory on the map. I'm sure we're going to try buying that and really focus on doing all the sugar stuff first. We'll, we'll add the other stuff after, but I've never done sugar cane, so why not do something different and something new? So hang on, what? Let's look at the map here. The road I'm running on, because I was just owned to buy those fields. And they're whew, like half a million dollars for some of them. Okay, yeah, like I said, we'll just cheat in a million dollars and then cheat out the million dollars after. We'll buy, buy the field, place a name, and sell the field. Ooh, olives and grapes sounds like fun to do. Yeah, that sounds like a lot of fun to do. Instead of doing the traditional farming stuff we're doing on the other map, do all the other things on this map. I like that idea. I think we should start the names right over here. All right, so let's save and quit. Once I've got this set up, once we put the names up and cheated the money back out, anybody can come and join. Till then, just just hold off a minute. Is that better? Over here it still says we don't have money, or a lot of money, but as soon as we start the game there should be un... Basically it should just read 999999 across the top. There's easier ways to do that? Ha! You can do it with a mod in game without. Yeah, you could do that. And I wouldn't even have to save and quit. But that means I have to add a mod to a game I want to have as few mods as possible.
Why did I start here again? Oh, it doesn't save player position. Uh, is that a mod I can add? Cause is that a script? Okay, that's annoying. Read nine 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 at the top. I, I it reads a huge number, but not the number I entered. It's definitely not the number I entered. Yeah, it's very weird. It's not the number I entered. I mean, it's a lot of money, but it's not what I entered. buying this field. Now, if I buy the field and place something and then sell the field, will my placeable stay on there? It just says no. Just as there is a way. So let's put a big K here. So let's now sell, cannot sell. Okay, so none of that helped me anything. Quit game. Yes, without saving. I don't have the place anywhere mod. Yeah, no, but how do I get that mod? It's not even in Mod Hub anymore. Place anywhere mod. Let's find that in the old in the other folder and copy it to place anywhere. I don't have it on here either. So if I delete that mod after, it, those things will stay there? I uh, don't have that either in here. Place. Placeable extended. Uh, in my old ones. I just need place anywhere. be called something else, like placeable extended. It's only I can see. Probably like strawberry. What? Or your favorite food. Grapes and strawberries, yeah. Um, okay, I'm going to try that. Placeable extended. Who knew setting up a map would be this hard? And I've been working on other stuff like. 
just getting prepped for this forever. Greenhouses would be fun to add to this. I like that idea. Placeable extended. Hey, Mimi. Okay. Um, we threw Coyote Dreams up. We never threw Michael up. Was in the house as well. I'm distracted. We'll get to farming eventually, I promise. Oh, I'm gonna be at my house again. Oh, that's gonna get annoying. What's the solution? Sell that house place a house at our field. Yeah, probably a thing we're going to have to go do. What is today? What is today? Today is Sunday? What else is today? Favorite production chain? I don't think I have a favorite production chain. I should be walking on the other side of the road. It's dangerous walking on this side. I like it. This car is just dipping by Try this again. Land is not owned by you. Did I not turn it on? I swear I turned it on. Is that mod? Let's go look at the mod. Ah, uh, it's just not working. What? Fix this for me. Make sure it's the right mod. Hi, game. Object can be placed inside the other, so that's not the one we want. Find the right mod, that's what I know. that's what I need. Fences anywhere. Yes, I tried that. It didn't work. It said I didn't own the land. That's why I'm being frustrated. Yes, I tried that. Okay, 
So let's set that. place anywhere. What if it's called something else? Because place anywhere mod was on farm or was on mod hub for a little bit. The ride home was pretty good. It was fast. Let's just say I was following the speed of other traffic. And the other traffic was fast. It's crystal extendable. It's, I thought that was the one. Maybe somebody can help me. Oh, sorry, Jaden, I didn't actually acknowledge your appearance. Because Jace is in here, and then all of a sudden Jaden, and it's like, oh, that's so similar, I, rec uh, I registered that as the same person. Okay. too many things. I broke it. That's it. That's it, guys. We're done. Form anywhere, does it allow you to place as well? So many mods. <laughs> Just to make this map work. Maybe we should give up on the map. Should we give up on the map? Or do you guys actually want to see? Oh, um, James. Um, you haven't done an oil change on my bike yet. Um, I suspect I have an oil leak. If I need a new gasket somewhere, can you just replace it and charge me money for replacing it? Maybe, I don't even know how to check the oil level on that thing. Maybe make sure I have oil in the, in the engine. So, yeah, I, there, there's quite a bit of oil under the, under the engine. I, I, I think I've got a bad seal. Or a bad gasket. And if it doesn't need to be fixed, it's fine. I just don't want, you know, to blow out a gasket and be stranded in the middle of nowhere. If 
it's not if it's a gasket that's not under pressure and isn't going to blow out, it'll just continually just have a minor minor little leak. I'm fine with that. The biker community is slowing down now, Michael. Okay. Jess says she's found it out. Figured it out. So, um, paint and terraform anywhere. Copy that into cross platform, paste, and then we'll go back and delete it after. Right, cross platform. Make this our active mod. Launch game. Oh, okay, let's try this. Let's try this. I hope it works. The higher temperatures are making less bite. What, what the heck's wrong with your bikers, Michael? Why would you not keep biking no matter how hot? Texas, why wouldn't you just bike all year round? There's probably a couple of days it doesn't get cold enough. Oh, that sounds like fun, uh, Jace. Michael, do you suspect ball capping? Just does not suspect. Ah, okay. I I agree with Jess now. I no longer suspect ball caps. No more baseball. Okay, continue. Start. Let's place this, quit the game one more time, and then we can actually play. I know, I'm like, I'll live stream. We're almost set up. I'll start the live stream. I've been working forever just to try to get to this point. Set the farm up. We're good. We're almost there. No. Yeah, I guess it does get too hot, but... You know, plus 40, plus 40, it'd be unbearable. So Jace, what do you do with a horse that breaks their leg? Uh, you bring him to, or get a veterinary to come out and Splint, splint the leg, or, or unfortunately, do you have to put them down? I guess it depends on what, what kind of horse, too, right? Or is a broken leg for a horse a death penalty or a death sentence? truth. through that whole list now and put everybody's name in there. Okay. 
Uh, I'm gonna have to add the place anywhere mod as well. Because it's not letting me put the letters too close to get close enough together. Alright. We got a K. Save game. The cure has to be okay with me. K. If you like tea, I will never say no to tea. Okay, maybe I've said no to tea before. What? I don't know what you're talking about. What? Tea, bacon, and cinnamon roll. really into those cinnamon rolls. Yeah, I'm not really into them. What am I trying to do? I'm trying to put the people that have donated money to charity on the map, their names on the map. And once that's done, we can... Then we can actually start playing. Where's place anywhere? I swear. It might not be in here. It has to be in there. Basically, that's what But I also want to make the game cross-platform so we can't keep these mods here for people to be able to join. Hey Colton! Coyote is good, but coffee, 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 coffee starts to see. <laughs> oh, it's funny. So, people that donate money using the link down below through Extra Life, we're trying to fundraise to $3,766.16. So far, we're at 347 and what, 30 cents or something like that? Whoever helps donate gets their name on our maps whenever we play it. Except I'm doing cross-platform and I'm trying to get the mods to work. Or, or the, the letters to work without having to buy all the property and cheat in, you know. It's difficult. It's difficult. You guys have played Xbox PlayStation. There is no mod that allows you to save player position, is there? That's a script, right? At least we have time in game, and it's gonna be a long while before we have to see it, so we have time. I would love my player not to always start at that house. It's that annoying. If you put a house somewhere else in a new place, does the player start at that house instead? Because if so, we're going to sell that property and build a house somewhere else as soon as we have money. Okay. Okay. At least that'll be something I can do. Because on PC, it, it, you start... I have a mod that just lets you start the game where you ended the game. Alright. Place these people's names. Give them all a shout out. Yeah. I know this. 
is not I, but I want to line the letters up with the road. Nice and flush with the road before switching to I. See, now I can place them next to each other. Nice and close. All right, that's where we're, we're cooking now. I can put them right on the road. Kiram Gaming was the first person that donated. Should just put a placeholder letter there. Gaming does farming sim as well. So check out his channel. In fact, he'll be live today later on. Probably in about two and a half, three hours. some rhino is next. Also a YouTuber. Here's some rhino too. Honestly, he's got he's got a huge following. He's pretty pretty big big time in the YouTube farming sim YouTube world. Lots of role play stuff. third language. Although, don't ask me to speak my first two languages because English is the best language I can spell. Or, or <laughs> well, maybe not. Uh, my third language, I'm the best at my third language and it's not very good. some rhino up. We need five spaces, right? One, two, three, four, five. 
Uh, next is Iron Thunder, also a YouTuber. In fact, he made the map Gnantel, which we should play on more often, but it's so huge. If he makes Gnantel in a cross-platform version, we will definitely play that as a cross-platform map in the future. Maybe even set up a server of that. That'd be cool. Thunder, right? There we go, Iron Thunder. Five more names to go. One, two, three. Four. We're kind of moving closer to the road here. So we can go back there. Five. Alright, uh, next is Tori the Fluff and Bunny. Oh boy. This is a long name. We have the a signpost there. Should be okay. Just a signpost. I know this is Thrilling, thrilling YouTube content, right? Tori Space. Fluffin, right? A lot of F's in Tori the Fluffin Bunny. here just just uh, writing out people's names I, I, I wanted to do all of this offline but I just ran out of time well might as well live stream this and I didn't think it was gonna take this long though I thought we'd be long playing by now all right we've got four more names to go The road is slowly turning because the letters are not lining up anymore because I line it up with the road. One, two, three, four, five. All right, next is Coyote Dreams.
Coyote Dreams. What? Have you tried some? I'm just not a big fan. There's some weird mixed flavors there. And textures. Had one, and I'm like, eh, not a big fan. Kayo. Why is it Kai? Is the first O silent? Kayo. Shouldn't it be Coyote? Coyote? Welcome back, Father Mick. We don't have art from Father Mick, do we? Jess says she's made art for Father Mick, and I've just been not putting it out. Well, I guess we'll just have to put it up. Let's take a look here. Let's finish Coyote Dreams here. Stream just changed setting up cross platform map because we're not actually playing. Okay, Coyote Dreams is in. Okay, now let's quickly let's take a look here. Let's see, do we have a father? Father Mick. see a father Mick. I actually see three different Jameses. James only ever seen one of his Jameses. And there is no father Mick on here. No, I'm going to try my flash drive. See Father Mick on here either. Hmm? Oh, I gotta choose between these. This is Father Mick or this one. Which one's Father Mick? Oh, you guys can't see, can you? Oh, so this, yeah, okay. The whole time I've been outside of the folders, you just haven't. That works for Father Mick, right? But, but for Father Mick, I was sort of hoping for a, a you know, a, a father with, with, I, I know he's a, but I was hoping for like a priest, a gaming priest. Unless you really like these. A, B. Let me know if you like A or B. Okay, let's do a little more letters here. Coyote Dreams. A. All right. Dump that in here. Okay, this is a little bit of work. Need to 
add an image to OBS. There's no writing on that. Uh, don't want that. No, go, go away. Open with Affinity Photo. I do like the new logo you made, just the controller with a line straight through it. And the yellow and black appeals to me. I have a account that has the yellow and black. does not like editing while <laughs> it's all lowercase isn't it father Nick gaming we got farming sim running OBS running Two live streams running and now trying to edit. There's a little too much for this computer to handle. Here we go. Let's throw up a random fluffin, Tori the fluffin bunny, just so that we can. Whoa! Not do that. Get you the same size as. for the vertical or for the horizontal let's do the same thing for the vertical now Add image Okay. Turn that off. All right. Now, only one step left. Copy that button. Just paste that button. Open that. all of these.
refresh. Okay. Tori the Fluffin' Bunny down. Okay, let's get back to our game. Now when I hit the button, Father Mick Gaming shows up. All that work. All right, Coyote Dreams just got done. Let's put in Linda. So Linda actually has a at symbol over here, but there is no at symbol in here. We have an and, but no at symbol. So just gotta leave a leave a space there. way to put hang on okay delete all of Linda bye bye Linda H has become my generic space. That way all the spaces are the same size. Five. Uh, next is sinfully sinister. We got two names left and then we can save and quit, get rid of those mods, and then we're ready for cross-platform gameplay. We'll actually do some playing.
And then only one name left. And that's the ramps. Alright, how long have we been streaming for? An hour and 18 minutes just to do that. Kirim Gaming, Fearsome Rhino 2, Iron Thunder, Tori the Fluff and Bunny, Coyote Dreams, Linda 2, Sinfully Sinister, and the Reps. Thank you for your donations! Has anyone donated been in the meanwhile and have to add more names? I mean, that'd be awesome, but... Okay, let's save and quit. Cheat out the money, cheat out, or take out the mods, and then... And then anyone can join us. Big Ten, how's it going? Oh, Practical Theory, how's it going? Um. What am I doing? Where am I? Where am I and what'd you do? Um, that's not what I... Oh, yeah, okay, right, 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 I remember. Okay. Save game. Ten... Farms. Uh, we had like two thousand eight hundred something dollars. We'll just put in nine hundred. I can't remember. Save. Um, launch game. Let's see. See if we're actually going to play for once. Uh. Alright. Uninstall. Yes. Did I reinstall it? Okay, it's gone. Back. Multiplayer. Everybody, come on in. Yes, I want to continue without those mods. We only have a few mods. The fences, the map forced us to do, and then we have the sugarcane technology stuff that came with the map at the same time, the map uh, El Dorado. And then just the placeable glowing symbols. That's it. Continue. Password is all lowercase, just ask, A-S-K. Let's play! 
both letters are all gone, I'll be pissed. <laughs> Let's hope the money is right as well. Uh... So I guess the first thing we have to do is start plowing. Big Ten, when you get home, you might join. That'd be awesome. But we finally have it set up. We have it set up for a cross-platform game. If a lot of people join over time, I might try to do this map once a weekend. I still want to keep playing the other map on a regular basis. But maybe we'll try to do cross-platform once a weekend. I'm thinking I would prefer to do it on Friday nights. Well, depending on where we get the most questions for platform, what basically we'll probably ask we'll we'll let we'll let you guys decide. The more people join on a certain day, that's which day we will most likely do the cross-platform map. are all there. I'm happy. Okay, we should be able to just tab. Yeah, there's our vehicle in the bush. Yeah, I got two tractors. So, I mean, when people join, there's not much to do here, but when people join, there, there's, there's something to do. Put in the big version. I installed the big version. I'm like the letters are huge. There is a password king. The password is ask. A S K all lowercase. And yeah, there's not much to do on this farm. There is something to do on this farm. At least there is something to do. Hmm, I should really take this with the other tractor because we're going to want to stack pallets on trailers and stuff with this tractor. So this tractor will be for transportation. stuff and we got to bring this all to the field. But I'll start by going around the field to see if we want to make it any bigger, great field or whatever. Okay. 
one tiny little field over over half a million dollars of debt which is game where this map does not allow you to go more than half a million dollars of debt so you know I had to cheat in more debt so why would we make the game easier come on Cool, we get to drive by those names now. So, oh yeah, so every time we have to place more names, we have to use that mo those mods. I shouldn't have uninstalled them, I should have just not selected them. Oh well, that's okay. How's it going, Farm Sim Freak? Welcome to the stream. Coming by and doing the oblig obligatory hello, 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 and then busy off doing your own thing, I'm assuming. I know I always do that to all you, the rest of you YouTubers. If, if you guys don't know Farm Sim Freak, he YouTubes a lot of uh, farming sim as well. Gates there. Oh, that's actually not this one. side road. It's closed. Just finished cleaning up the stream room. Cleaning up? Who cleans up? Look at the pigsty beside me. I'm a messy person. I'm definitely a messy person. I'm not quite a hoarder, but messy. Oh, we need to exit here. So we should turn traffic off because of multiplayer and lag. Oh yeah, that'd be interesting if people join. Where am I going? This way. This way. I don't know where my own farm is. I'm still loading the chaders. Jump the curb. field a little bigger so we can make as much money as possible. Oh, there's a second driveway here. Is that the official driveway? It looks prettier than the other driveway, but it's pretty small for equipment. Maybe the house will eventually end up being on this end. But we have no money to move the house over here, so for now the field will be bigger. And then in the future it will shrink again. out on debt, max <laughs> we just have to wait and make some money first before we can buy anything else. If people start joining here, we'll have to probably rent a server. Oh, 
that's cool farm sim freak so everybody make sure you guys head to farm sim freak on april 30th which is a tuesday we try to give away 10 copies of a new dlc between pc and console so basically you're just going to ask if you're on console or on pc and it's a steam steam giveaway or Hello, Holden. How's it going? Cool. I'm always busy during the week, so I can't uh, come and hang out, but um, that is, is cool. You should, um... What? Pin what? I didn't want to pin the message. That's not what I was asking. She, she's assuming. She's assuming things. I don't remember what I was doing. I was going to ask you to share a link to some Farm Sim Freaks channel. Went right into the. I can't do that. I'm like, I didn't even ask you. I didn't even ask you to do anything yet. Be our field, our first field. We're gonna have to learn how to deal with sugar cane. Mm. I want to go in cab view, but I know none of the traders are loaded yet. Heck of a laggy transition. Well, it just froze. Froze. <laughs> uh, need to load these chaters when we're not live streaming. Eventually have to get loaded. guys like better in cab view or out of cab view
Another thing I wish the game would improve, when the birds and deer get loaded in, they load right next to you instead of loading off in the distance and then fading in. Wish they didn't make that so jarring. Takes a while to download these mods. Just the map, right? I do appreciate that farming sim have done a good job of the steering wheel in cab, but when you're playing with a steering wheel, I've got a Thunder Master, Thunder Master um, steering wheel here, and as I move the steering wheel on, on my actual wheel here, it matches exactly what the game, the game steering wheel does. Real, like, real world steering wheel matches exactly. So if I put my finger right on the on where the spoke is on the right hand side and move my finger over, my finger's at the top over here, pointed sideways there, pointed to the bottom over here. It matches like dead on. So that that's pretty pretty cool. Hey Dennis, how's it going? We're doing good. Cross platform. Playing cross-platform for like the first time in a long, long time. So say remove this, remove that, and do squaring off these corners here a bit. I feel like just squaring off this corner, period. seed. Obviously this field over here will be our next field we buy. <laughs> it just makes sense. I think that's what we're going to do is we're going to grow this field Sell everything on here, take half the money we made, pay off debt, 
the other half will save for expenses and save up to buy more property. That way we're saving up to buy stuff and paying off. Or just pay off debt until we can borrow enough to buy. I don't know. Maybe not saving and paying off more debt will save us more money because we're paying less interest. That seems the better better way of doing that. It's a little funky little Soften this corner. Yeah, I like that better. We'll see if anyone joins us here. If people join, maybe play it more often. If nobody joins, we might play it once a month. I don't know. We'll see. Nobody said they're going to join. Some people have asked about joining, but nobody said they would. Let's square up this corner as well. Looking at my teeth, it's all gone. Is that an actual barrier we can hit? Let's just nudge into it and see if it's uh, something you can drive through or a barrier you can hit. Oh. There's a bump there, but you can drive right through it. Okay. That's interesting. Jess sounded like she was joining, but I guess that hasn't happened either. Downloading mods. I guess the other people that said they might, or they're probably downloading mods too. Not that there's anything to do on here, I just wanted to see what it does to my computer when people join. I Michael just jumps in and goes, Hi! Yeah. You're already here. You, where, where's the? I'm back. Where's, where's that? One eternity later. That's a weird anniversary. 112. Not really. A, I guess you had that come up in your newsfeed or something. Today, 112 years ago, the Titanic is said to be sunk. It's actually a 
lot of circumstantial evidence that would make you question if 112 years ago the Titanic actually sunk. Follow the money. Follow the money. Farmer Joe joining. Arnold to say I'm back. Whoa! That's the quickest synchronization I've ever had. What? Just a, a blip. Hardly any mods. No DLCs. you're working is 112, 22 years old. I think a lot of factories are about 122 years old. Because during World War II, a lot of factories got built. Two was was the industrial revolution really right?
one more round, and then I'll start bringing equipment and everything to the farm here and get the rest of the farm set up just so that we get that done. And For a tractor. The grass was eight inches tall, and last week it was an inch and one point one inches tall last week. So it grew, the grass grew seven point nine inches. Because the 1.1 inch was definitely not ball camping. Actually, I have a question. Did Chase ever answer my question? Yes, but I don't know what the yes was for. The other job is stacking pallets on trailers with, with the front end forklift on the other tractor and moving all that over here to this farm and unstacking them. That, that sounds like a fun job, right? my GPS mod, absolutely. There we go.
What's that? Are you blind? She says she can't see what's been plowed or has it. Is that what you said? Missing. You, have, you have to basically run the tires on the plow area already. You gotta be a little overlapping. through that. Yeah, with the plow you pretty much have to run the front tire on the already plowed area. Or else it'll be missing with that plow. Most plows are. I'm going to strap down as soon as between each pallet I'm going to strap down so these don't fall off. Pretty good. I guess when we do our first harvest of cane sugar, we have nowhere to store it. We're going to be forced to sell it as we harvest it. Which is not the optimal way of making money. 
unless there's a place on the map that you can store it. When is the longest day of the year? Because that's my favorite day of the year. What's that? Well, no kidding. Our days are becoming longer, but when is the longest day of the year? <coughs> Still driving a little bit at night, but it's certainly making it easier to shoot videos when days are that much longer. shoot the best part of the highway instead of the part of the highway that you're going to be in sunshine for. Point hitch on the front, it does. Okay, perfect. We'll do some multitasking here. Can't, can't hook on a lot of this stuff. Right? Hook on some stuff. It's a quiet day in chat today, isn't it? Trailer loaded. Let's go detach our front end loader here so we can transport something else to the yard at the same time. One less trip. Cultivator up front. Oh, how are we supposed to unload this without a forklift on the front? Darn it. that through, did I? Ok, 
can we? Hello, Ollie. So let's wonder if we can lift this high enough. We'll just drive with it up. Okay, that seems to work. Seems to work. Okay. No, it's been dry for us so far, Michael. But our wet season doesn't really hit until next month. Still hopeful getting some moisture, but it's been pretty dry so far. I mean, we had a lot of overcast, a little bit of rain here, but not like a lot. We, we are, we're already in drought conditions. the place. You guys have had a lot of flooding in spring. Yeah, no, there's no chance of flooding here yet. seems to like roundabouts. Yeah, that's a big roundabout there. More like an oval about. <laughs> it's 
that's the right way to go to the farm. I've seen uh, a lot of YouTube live tornado chasers getting, getting to do their thing. Hmm? Hi? Are you saying hi? Oh, okay. I'm so confused. Figuring this out. This front end forklift is definitely a challenge to use. But I think I'm doing all right. I don't know. The sugar cane in real life? Yeah? Do you have to keep reseeding sugar cane? I don't know. Sugar cane, you plant it once and it's good to go. Like grass. I don't know the answers to that. I've never done sugar cane. I have no idea.
light on. Shake it on. Definitely intense. Maybe not for you guys, but this is intense. You guys won't have a fire problem this year because you guys well just because you have flood now it doesn't mean you're not gonna have drought later. Dropping the pallets is harder than picking them up. You guys nearly need a boat now, but that doesn't mean that it's not going to get all completely dried out and then you're going to get no rain for months and then by fall you guys are going to have fires everywhere. Because we've had some very wet years that still turn into a crazy forest fire year, but it is less, less rare or less common to have forest fires in a wet year, which makes sense, but it doesn't mean that just because this year starts wet it's going to remain wet. Has worked. Why can't it do that every time? What? You can't predict the future? Have you seen the movie Madame Webb? Good movie.
Let go. Hey, Chef Mickey. Mikey? Chef Mikey? Okay, we got that unloaded. That's. It's only one. It's only a small dent in the. Oh boy. Oh yeah. I'm sorry, James. We're not gonna enjoy this. Back to the store. I don't think we've loaded chaters that way yet. How do we get back on the highway? Uh, not this way. Shoot. Um, we should have gone under the overpass. Okay. Next time. How do we fix this? Probably call this the end of the stream then. Let's, let's back to the farm. Oh, I see the edge of the map here. Oh, we need a U turn here somewhere. Hello, whoever owns this. We're just coming in to turn around. Don't mind us. Pretty big storage area. Lots of wheat though. Let's get back on the highway. Is there a little side road here we can drive along instead of driving on the highway? Nope, that just goes to a field. Back to the store. And drop the trailer there and call it a day because I'm getting hungry. And we've got this farm partially set up. At least Jess is right now plowing. Probably almost done plowing. And we'll get into planting some sugar cane. We've, we've made some progress. I have no idea what's for lunch. It was supposed to be breakfast. 
cinnamon rolls and bacon, but I didn't much like the cinnamon rolls. And then Jessica like, what? What's wrong with cinnamon rolls? She tried it and goes, yeah, okay. <laughs> that doesn't make a lot of sense. So, I don't know. I don't know what's for lunch. So I'm not really a fan of what the plan is. The bacon part sounds good. Jess has an idea. My computer should handle it, but doing it is too much work, so it actually hampers the live stream, the, it, it hampers everything. Well, nobody joined us, so I still see no reason to do crossplay. But we will try it a couple more times just for the sake of learning sugar cane and doing something a little different and mixing it up. And that's going to be it for this week. Uh, James should probably be doing a live stream tomorrow morning-ish for an hour or so. He's been playing European Truck Simulator recently. And then we should be back. Mike would go, see you later? What part of this is, we're done for this week do you not understand? <laughs> we're going to work. It's Sunday, right? Today's Sunday? Today is Sunday. Going to work. We start work on Sunday. Right. Most of the time we start work on a Sunday. Every now and then we don't. Technically we wouldn't have to do on this one Sunday, but we'd have to start like at 3 a.m. tomorrow to make it work. Like we, we literally don't know if we're going to be home next weekend. That's just how the trucking industry works. So I know I won't be home until next Friday, or at least I hope I won't be home until next Friday, because or else, else, or else something went wrong at work. But hopefully we're home next weekend. If so, we'll see you guys probably Saturday morning. If we get home early enough on Friday, maybe Friday evening. But we're just gonna have to wait and see how the week works out. Feel free to ask in our trucking channel chat how the week's going. Ask, ask, ask on a Friday if we'll be home on the weekend. So, so everybody log into the other channel. Link down below, just Juan Rempel. Um, check the channel out 
on Friday you can ask me what the next live stream will be on here because by Friday not even necessarily Friday morning but by Friday afternoon we should know just how the trucking industry is you just we don't have a schedule we sort of have a schedule but we don't have a guaranteed schedule there is no such thing as a guaranteed schedule you never know when you're gonna be home most of the time it's Friday but what time on Friday yeah no idea I do know this on Monday I will be in Alberta. So tomorrow I will be in Alberta. Jess hopefully will be in Alberta too. Well you were threatening to stay here so I don't know anymore. You're, you're going with? Okay so Jess and I will be in Alberta tomorrow. That is what I do know. Well even that's not a hundred percent. But that's what the plan is. Plan is to be in Alberta tomorrow. Let's see. I know it's not a big cross country run yet, but at least we're going to Alberta. It's just Fort McLeod. So that's just on Highway 3. So we will be stuck on Highway 3, but not not the same view of Highway 3 that we've been getting over and over and over. So I'm looking forward to some new scenery on Monday. Tomorrow. What's the title of Highway 3, Other Direction? No, I don't like it. I don't like it. Most likely Monday's video will be Highway 33 or something like that. Or loading at Interfor. I don't think we're loading anything on Oyama. I think we're just running empty to Grand Forks. That is, I think, unless something drops in, that's what it's going to be. But anyway, we're going to go eat lunch now. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thanks, Jess, for joining our map here. We've, we've kind of set up our map here. We've actually started turning soil, working the soil. So some progress has been made. Hopefully, as we do this map, more and more of you guys join, or else there's no point of doing this, because I miss my GPS. I miss all the other good mods that PC gets. I gotta, on this map, I have to play at the lower tier that the consoles have to play at. But, eh, it is what it is. For now, we are out of here. You guys absolutely rock. Thanks, Coyote Dreams. You also have a great week. This video is brought to you in part by the letter C and these YouTube members. Cookie starts with C. What other things start with C? Oh, who cares what other things? C is for Cookie and that's good enough for me. Thanks for watching. Um, nom 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 nom.